Hilton Garden in Jonas speaking. Hi, Cap. Yeah, hi, my name's Bill. I just called you a couple of minutes ago. You did transfer me to the room, but it was um, unoccupied. Okay. Can you, can you transfer me to one that's unoccupied, um, please? Just one minute. Okay, thank you. Hello? Yes, hi. How you doing, sir? Fine. Um, I work here at the front desk. Okay. Um, um, we have um, a specialty. It just got started um, ever since the uh, end of December. And it's, um, you get a hooker for $50. <laughs> you fucker. Is it possible Man, that... Man, you had me going. No, seriously. Would you like a hooker sent to your room for $50 extra? It'd be at, it, would, it would probably be covered to your um, room service. Yeah, sure. Would you like one? We have different kinds. We have Asian. We even just got one from India. Oh, sure. A new one. Her name's Hajni. Is it possible you'd be interested in that? Sure. And and who's calling? My name's Bill. Bill. And where are you calling from? I'm calling from the front desk, sir. You really are? Yes. That's amazing, because I work here. You do? Yeah. You know, if you do work here, you're a dick. But, but I thought you said you worked there, so... I do, and like I'm saying... Well, why would you, you say work, if? You work for this company? This hotel? Yeah, but you said if. If you work there, you don't know who's working there? If you work for this hotel... Yeah. You are a dick. For doing what you're doing. If you don't work for this so hotel, you must be a, so you must be a, uh, if you a don't work for this hotel, then you are a real asshole. But I don't understand because you just said that you worked there. But then right. again, if you did work there, you wouldn't know everybody who worked here. So why? Well, it's just a huge hotel, and there's about a hundred employees. I don't think I would. But my point still stands. You're an asshole. All right. right. So right. stop are you, are you enjoying your stay? Stop calling. What are you going to do about it? What am I going to do about it? Yeah. I can trace the call, Dick. Oh, you are. I'm so scared right now. My dimples to get a pointy. Oh, oh, that's, you know, you're, you're just a real man. Yeah, I am. You are. You just see my oh, What do you look like? What are you wearing? What am I wearing? Yeah. I'm wearing the uniform you're wearing, you prick. Oh, yeah? What are you wearing? Come on, tell me. Um, I'm wearing a G-string thong. Really? It goes right up my ass. Oh, cool. Nice hairy ass I got. Just nah, I don't like hairy. You don't like hairy ones? Yeah. Uh, this one, you gotta like. I have a nice tight crap shooter. Really? Yeah. Cool. So are you enjoying your stay? No, no. But um, if you don't like the uh, female hookers, you do have some male ones, if that's what you're into. Only if you're one. It's you must be really bored. Well, to tell you the truth, if you were um, uninterested in this phone call, you would have gone hung up. <laughs> right? Hello? Yeah. Yes? Can you put your wife on the phone? Uh, Mark, I'm... Hey, uh, he doesn't have a wife. Who's this? It's a friend. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. so you guys must be gay. What? You guys must be gay because you're staying inside the same room. Are you sleeping in the same bed or you're inside of uh, one of those uh, married suites? Yes. Um, that guy just said you two are staying inside the same room and you're really close friends and you sleep with a thumb up each other's ass? Absolutely. Is that true? You sound very interested in gay stuff. Yes, I am. I'll bet you are. I may be some interested in gay stuff, but I'm not staying in a room right now with a guy in the same bed. How do I know? Why do you want to know? Because I'm trying to offer you a special deal. I was trying to help you out. You were trying to help me out. But, you know what you, you, but the problem is you don't have what I, what I need. You're offering me women. Uh, what would I do with a woman? I don't know. You could talk to her. You, well, you could paint her nails. You could talk to her. You can watch Oprah together. I know gay guys like that show. You know, Dr. Phil, he's probably on...